In our last video, we explained that using CTO file can display only the relevant layers for a check. But back then, user could only create a CTO file by manually type layers or generate a CTO file from a EO server script. Starting from 2013.4 release, Caliber RVE and Interactive both provide options for users to generate CTO file from a given rule deck. When you check the option in the Caliber Interactive, we will automatically generate the CTO file after you finish the Caliber job according to the input rule file. And the output file name will be your RDB file name plus .cto extension. So, Every time when the user loads the RDB in RVE, this CTO file will be automatically loaded. In Caliber RVE, the option is from a pull-down menu. You will need to fill out the table to supply the name of the rule file and the output file name. If you are using Cadence for Choso, you will need to supply the optional layer map file. Then, we will generate the CTO file according to Virtuoso layer information, so the layers can be shown correctly in Virtuoso. If you're using Calibre Interactive to generate the CTO file, this option can be found in Setup, Preference, and go to the CTO File tab. Thanks for watching the video. My name is Yijun Tong. Caliber Technical Marketing Engineer, you can find out more information about Caliber products in the following locations.